what is the difference between a mosaic result and a segmental aneuploid result? These are two totally different terms that mean completely different things. Yet, you can have an embryo that has both mosaicism and segmental aneuploidy detected. So let's break it down. A mosaic result suggests that one embryo sample has a mix of different chromosome findings. Maybe some cells that are chromosomally typical with euploid results or 46 chromosomes, and some cells that are atypical or aneuploid with a missing or extra or multiple missing or extra chromosomes. A segmental aneuploid result is actually exactly what the name implies. It implies that a segment or a piece of a chromosome is lost or gained. And this is as opposed to a whole chromosome aneuploidy, where you see a loss or a gain of a whole chromosome. As I mentioned earlier, it's possible that you can see these results individually or together. What I mean by that is you could see an embryo result that suggests mosaicism of a whole chromosome aneuploidy. You could also see a result that suggests a segmental aneuploidy where no mosaicism was detected in the biopsy. And finally, it's possible you see them together. So you could see a result that suggests that a segmental aneuploidy was mosaic. If you've got questions about your results or how to interpret them, or you want to share your results with me and I can make a brief video on them, get in touch with me, make a comment down below, or send me a message.